Okay, so hey there guys. So today's video is going to be another installment in my What's in My Closet series. And today I'm going to be going through all of my Lucky Brand clothing with you guys. I am currently working at Lucky Brands. That's where I am employed right now. Um, I actually did just get back from work, so I'm still wearing what I wore to work. This is a Lucky shirt along with the jeans that I'm wearing. I'm going to go through all the denim first since we are really, uh, our denim is what we um, make and what is our signature um, fabric and pan. That's what we're known for is our jeans. So I'm going to go through our jeans first and then I'm going to go through all of our sh the shirts that I have and then I'm going to go through some flannels that are on the bed over there and a couple of other pieces and then... Um, a denim jacket and shorts. So I'm going to go through all my jeans first. I'm going to show you the ones that I'm wearing after I go through the ones that um, are sitting on my lap. So the first pair that I have are my newest pair that I've gotten. And these are our Ava jeans. These are the Ava skinnies. And I got them in this olive color because I've seen that this color is a really big color for fall. Um, these are skinny jeans. These ones fit a little bit um, shorter than the ones that I'm wearing. The ones that I'm wearing are called the Bridgets. Not the Bridgets, the um, Brooks. So these are the Avas. These are really, really nice. I love these. I've actually only worn these once so far because um, I really live in regular um, blue denim like so much. But I am going to get a lot more use out of these in the fall, like with other sweaters and stuff like that. So I'm really excited to start wearing these more. But that's what these ones look like. Um, if you want to see what they really look like unfolded, just go to the website and I'm sure you can find these. I'm not going to unfold every single pair, but I will show you the cuff on the bottom. See how they're like more skinny and straight legged. I really love these ones so far. They're really comfortable and I'm in a size 8. Um, you know what? I'll show them to you unfolded because you're not really going to be able to get an idea. I'm going to stand up to show you the jeans because it's just a little bit easier. Oh my god. Why does everything always have to get caught on everything for me? Right, we're just going to put them back here because it's just a bit easier. So these are the um, Ava jeans. If I can move my, no my class notebooks out of the way. Um, so these are what these look like. And I'm going to tilt the computer down more for you. Okay, so these are the skinnier jeans. And then these are the back. That's what they look like, okay? So that's the first pair. And then the ones I'm going to show you next are the ones that I'm wearing. I might as well since I'm already wearing these. I feel like they keep on falling down on me. Like, they're not, like, too... Um, too loose on me but I feel like they're just like on my hips a lot so these are called the brook legging jeans so these fit more like a straight legging so that's what these ones look like I'll show them show you the waist and everything I'll show them up close and then these are the bottoms that's what they look like and then the backs look like that really really cute and then I'll show you the bottoms you can see they look like that yeah so these are like the ones I wear the most I live in this pair because I really love dark denim um, so I wear these all the time and I'm also a size 8 in these and then the last like regular jean that I have from them are called the Bridget's and these are our high-rise jeans like the Brooks and the Ava's I think are more of a mid-rise um, but these are more of our high-rise jeans, and obviously high-rise jeans are very in right now. People wear them a lot with, like, shorter um, crop tops and stuff like that, and they, it looks really cute. I can't wait to wear something like that. I'm probably going to wear that, like, this weekend. So this is what these look like. These ones are a lighter wash than the ones that I'm wearing, and they are a little bit bigger in the hips, and then they taper off to a skinnier jean as well. And then the backs look like this. And then these are the bottoms. So, yeah. Again, I'm an 8 in all of our jeans. Um, I used to be a 10, so I'm really happy that I got down to an 8. And then the last two pairs, these are both the exact same thing. So, I only, I'm only going to show you one. Um, these are our brand new Lucky Leggings. 
And I needed to replace my denim leggings like so badly. And the only ones that I had were ones from Hue. So I'm like, mom, I need to replace them. And when I, when you first get hired there, they have you try on all of the denim. Like if you're a girl, obviously you try on all the women's denim. And if you're a guy, you try on all the guys' denim. Um, so I automatically, I mean, I was dying to try these on because I was like, I'm sure I'm going to fall in love with them. I, as soon as I tried them on, I fell in love with them. These are so flipping comfortable. Like all of our jeans are so comfortable to wear. And that's why like they just make them a really nice stretchy fabric. So these are the lucky leggings. And these are, I think that these are our first go at leggings. They're very high waisted. So you don't have to worry about them like, um, you know, getting lowered down like other ones do with just like a regular elastic waist. Like I like that these are high, a little bit higher and they only come in the dark wash. I wish that they did a light wash too, but I was like, mom, I'm just going to get two pairs because I love them. And they're completely straight legged. And then the back has pockets, which I really like. And then it also, um, is the same in the back. So this is what the back looks like. I know they're a little bit look like they're bunched up right now, but my mom just washed them again. Um, and I'm a medium in these, um, so I would say probably size up a little bit, um, because they do shrink, um, but I've been getting so used to wearing the mediums now, I feel like the first time my mom wore them, I mean, I mean, my, the first time my mom washed them, I feel like they were, um, a little bit tight on me. So that's it for the denim, and now we'll move on to tops since I'm already standing, and Actually, let me just show you the one pair of shorts that I have. So these are the shorts that I have. I only have one pair because I kind of found these towards like the end of summertime. And I really, really like these. But even my manager told me that they don't feel like um, Lucky has perfected shorts yet. They feel like their denim is, is better in jeans than they are in shorts. Like look how cute these are. They're really, really cute. They have little rips here. And they're like a lighter wash and they have like the really cute white embroidery and then they like have the distressed um, bottoms and then the backs obviously ha back has pockets and has the distressed bottom again. And I really think they're so cute on but they are too tight on me. Um, I'm going to try, I mean, I'm not going to wear them again until next summer. Maybe I'll lose more weight or something, and I'll see if they fit then, because I never really wore these um, when my mom got them, and I only got them a month ago. I was still wearing my BB jean uh, shorts more, but I'll see how these fit next season um, when the summer rolls around again. So that's it for those, and now let's move on to all of my tops. I just want to make sure I don't forget this. So I'm going to put it over here. Okay. So now I can show you the one that I'm wearing. So this one is a navy top with in, like blue and white embroidery. I really like it. It kind of reminds me of like Native American style. I think it looks really, really cool. And uh, I'm not saying that to be offensive. It just really reminds me of that. Um, and it's a short sleeve top. It's really lightweight, so you can wear this whenever, but I feel like it's more of a fall time kind of shirt because just because of the colors. And then the back is just solid navy. So it's a really easy, like, cute shirt to wear. Like, that's what I love wearing, obviously, and that's what most people love wearing is cute but comfy. Like, something that they can just throw on and they don't really need to put any effort into what they're wearing, and that's what I like. Um, so I wore this to work today. And this is a last year uh, top, like last season. Um, I think it was like a fall top last year. So I got this last year. And then there's some stuff from this year and then some stuff from like a long time ago when I like shopped at Bloomingdale's for Lucky. So we're going to go through all of the shirts now. Um, I'm going to go through. These are all mostly recent shirts that I just got. Um, I'm going to go through those after... The ones that are a little bit older. It's crazy like how I bought like shirts there like not even like I don't even know like a couple months ago and they're not even in the store anymore. Like that's how fast some of these like go out of the store. It's like insane. So these are the newer ones and these are the oh actually I'm forgetting one. Damn I gotta grab that one too. 
Sorry, I didn't want to forget that one. That one I got like not even that long ago, like a couple weeks ago. So I don't want to forget it. So this one is a pretty old one. I'm pretty sure I don't have the matching sweater anymore because I think it was too small on me. I don't think I kept it. I don't think I have it. I'm pretty sure I don't. Um, it was just like a, it was a really cute purple sweater. I don't think I have it anymore. I'm pretty sure I don't. So this is a really old, is this from, yes it is. It's Lucky Tees, and this is a really old um, long sleeve thermal shirt from them. And this is what it looks like. I really love this shirt. I wear it a lot in the winter time or fall time. And it has a really pretty like floral, um, navy, purple, gray floral design on it. It's just in a circle and the whole shirt is gray thermal and then the backing is also thermal. Really love this one. Um, so I'm excited to start wearing it again in the fall and winter time because it's still too hot for that. Even though I kind of look a little fallish today, it is way too hot outside. It's like 85 degrees. So yeah, um, I was wearing like a jacket over um, this at, at work because we're supposed to wear like three pieces. You have to wear like a shirt, a jacket, and like a necklace. So, um, but I was like dying in that. But, um, I mean, I was, it wasn't like too hot, but yeah. So this is the first shirt that I have. So let's just put that over there. Okay, now let's get into the older shirts that I have. I don't know why I stack these like this. Okay, so these ones are a little bit older and then we'll get into the newer shirts. So these ones are from like summer, like early summertime, like spring, summer. So the first one I have is this red t-shirt that has like floral design on it. I like lived in these three shirts that I'm showing you for most of the summertime. Like I wore these so much because um, they were just easy to wear. And plus like I get really excited to wear new clothing. So I wear it like all the time. So this is what this looks like, and it has like a little drawstring um, pull that you just um, tie, and then the back is the same design. It's a really, really cute one. I don't really have too much red in my collection, and I'm literally wearing like two shirts that I have red in, and then I literally only have like one more. I mostly bought like red and navy. That's mostly the colors that I have from Lucky because I feel like they do those colors the most. Okay, this one wasn't doing this at work. It was this one that was being a pain and now that one's being a pain and it's really annoying me. But yeah, really love this one. It's a really nice soft fabric and I am a small in this one. I think I'm a small, no, I'm a medium in the other one that I showed you. Then I have this one, which was like my favorite one that I got. This is just a white t-shirt with floral design on it. My mom got the um, one that had yellow flowers on it, but I think she returned it because it was like too sheer for her. But I can get away with it. I don't know, like it's not like she that sheer on me, but I love this top. I wear it so much. I wore this so much this past summer and the back looks like the same. It has blue and green flowers. I mean, blue flowers with green stems, obviously. And this one is in a size medium. This fabric is so soft, and I love wearing it with, like, just a pair of denim jeans, you know. Mostly all of these tops I'm showing you, I just pair them with denim jeans. Okay, and then the next one is a tank top. And this one is a green forest green tank top with like olive green I guess with gold leaves on it like gold studded leaves metallic ones this one actually they don't really have like a beaded fabric this is like actually on the shirt so you don't have to worry about it falling off which I really really like so that's what it looks like and then the back has the same design on it I also love that they put it in the back as well so I don't like um, some tops that don't have like the, the design on the back. So it's like it kind of gets boring, you know. Um, so this one is in a size small. So I'm either like a small or medium. I'm never usually a large in these because um, it runs like extra small to like extra large to extra large. I'm pretty sure. I think extra large. Oh my God, it's driving me nuts. Okay, so that is this top. I love this one as well. Again, I was living in this one, and I, again, pair it with either black jeans or regular denim jeans and just, like, a tan cardigan. So, 
Um, that's that one. And then the last one that I have from that season, this one's a long sleeve shirt. I love this shirt. This is a green, like aqua green shirt. And it has such a gorgeous design on it. It has like um, flowers, tan, like I don't even know what color, like a light pink shade with like metallic gold leaves. And then the bottom has gold metallic. Um, it has a crown on it, which is pretty cool. And then it kind of has like a little fold. So it's not like completely straight. It's a little bit more higher in the middle. And I really like that. And then the back is all the green jersey. I think it's a jersey fabric. It's so pretty on. I love this one. And that's what it looks like. And this one is in a size, what size? Size small. So that one's a small as well. I wear this one again. I love wearing this with the Bridget jeans. And I wore this with like a white scarf to work and like a silver long necklace and it looked really cute so um I'm excited to wear it again in like the fall time so that one I can wear like whenever oh my gosh let's see why this is doing that it's driving me in freaking sane maybe that'll help I don't even know why it's doing that now it's driving me fucking crazy I'm sorry it's driving me nuts okay and then the newer shirts that I got Honestly, you get such a crazy discount on the shirts there that it's like nuts. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight newer shirts that I got. I didn't realize it was eight shirts. I thought I got like no shirts, but they're mostly like blue and red. So the first one I got is a t-shirt, but I get 50% off. So this is the gray t-shirt that I got. My mom said that she likes just these regular kind of t-shirts. So I got this one mostly for her. This one says the Lucky Brand Co. Los Angeles, California. Finest denim dungarees. Too tough to die. I don't really understand this part, but <laughs> I really like it. It's super comfortable, and I've worn this one like twice already. And then the back just has gray um, in the back. So it's a pretty basic t-shirt, and this one's a size small. It's a really nice soft fabric. Again, I wear this just with regular denim jeans and my denim jacket. I wear that denim jacket with like everything that I'm going to show you. Or I wear it with black jeans and a denim jacket so it's a little bit different and I do that a lot now. I've never done that before before I started working here and then my sister wore black jeans and um, a band t-shirt and a denim jacket and now I've been wearing that like all the time. So that is this one. Okay, then the next one I have is a band tee, and this is the only band tee that I got from them. But I really love Journey. I don't really love, like, the other bands, so I'm not going to, like, wear them if I don't really listen to them. I do like Journey, though. So this is my Journey tee, and this one has Journey, and it says um, Japan 81. So I guess they did, like, a huge concert there. I don't really know. I just really liked the shirt. And this one has like a bug design on it with like a red sun and it says journey and it's like a gray jersey fabric and then the back is just um, gray. But it what made it interesting is that, is that it has like the, um, I think it's called cold shoulder cutouts is what it's called. So like it's a little bit like off the shoulder so I really like that. So it has like these straps and this one is in a size small. And I wore this with the green Ava skinny jeans that I showed you and a denim jacket. And it looks so cute like that because the green denim jacket, I mean green denim um, jeans made them really different. Uh, made it like more exciting rather than just wearing regular denim. So that's that one. And then the next one I got, this one was like 10 bucks on, why is my dog barking? He's just barking at Luna because Luna is sitting on the table and he likes sitting there when um, somebody's watching TV. So anyway, this one I got for a really good price. It was like $15, $10 or something. The other ones were all half off for me, um, but the sale items are like 60% off. And I think this one wasn't stacked with a 25% off discount. I think it's only when they first go on sale when it's like a 50% off. I think you get an extra 25% off. Then I can't remember or if it's just regular sale, I think it's just 25% off. Um, so this one was like $15. So this one is a navy tank top. 
And this one looks like this. It has a button down and it has like a blue and green design on it. I really love the colors on this one. So that's what it looks like. Oh, it's so pretty. And the fabric's really nice. And then it has like a lace detailing on the um, straps. And then the back is all solid navy, again, with the lace um, on the back. And then this one is in a size extra small. I actually could get it away with an extra small too. So like their sizes don't really vary too much between extra small, small, and medium. I feel like the larges are definitely obviously like substantially bigger. So but this one's really pretty, and I love wearing it with this um, blue cardigan that I'm going to show you that I have from them. And then just either black jeans or denim. So I really like um, the last time I wore these wore this one, I wore it with black denim and um, a navy cardigan. It was really cute. Okay, then the next one that I have is a tank top from them. And this one I got specifically to go with a sweater, but I'm probably going to wear it a lot. So their tank tops, oh my God, so comfortable. And I just wore this two days ago with the sweater to work. Um, so this one is just a, it's just a navy tank top. I'm not really going to bore you with this. And then the back is obviously the same. It has like a V-neck back. And then this one is, this one is in a size medium. Oh my God, I can't talk right now. I'm like excited to eat, but I didn't want to take my lip off yet before I ate something. I'm not like starving, but I do want to eat a little something before my mom gets home and makes dinner at six o'clock. Um, so this one is like, um, it's a really nice soft fabric and it's a longer tank top. So it kind of fits over your hips a little bit down to, um, where my hips are. And it was a really nice, uh, soft fabric. And this one's in a, sh a size medium. I keep on wanting to say shade medium, like no, Kaylin, it's the size, not the shade. Okay, so that's that one. Hopefully my blush looks okay. I don't know, I wasn't like loving my blush today, but I don't care, I'm taking it off, so whatever. Okay, then the next top I have, I only have four more tops. So this one, I feel like we made this in like every single color, and I think the red one sold out. I think we only, ha we only have one left from what I saw in the store today. This was a pretty popular one. This one is a just a... um red button down um long tunic top and it has a pocket on the left sleeve on the left um shoulder area and it's really really cute in the back it has like a jersey fabric and then it has a little button on the bottom it's really really cute on i really like wearing this again with just denim jeans and a black um jersey velvet um jacket um it's a really nice light one for like the summertime it's like a jersey fabric and this one's in a size medium we have this in like green tan and like an orangey color um and i think like a pink i can't remember um but it was a really cute one i really like this one so i wore this in my um cvs drugstore makeup haul if you want to see it on me um, then the next one I have, and I've worn that one like twice. I have these in two different colors just to replace like, I really needed a new white tee because the white tees that I have, I have like two other ones. <coughs> one is from J. Crew, and I have them in like every single color because, um, me and my sister used to be obsessed with shopping at J. Crew. Okay, so anyway, this one's like a, um, white t-shirt like I said and it has like a little pocket on it and this one's like a again like a longer tunic top but I found that this is like a heavier fabric so I can sweat in this it's not like a light cotton fabric but it, it is nice for like summer to fall type of weather and I don't know what kind of fabric this is it's definitely a heavier fabric than like a traditional cotton this one is I just want to see what it is this one is, I found the care label, but there's no, whatever. It's just a heavier fabric, but I really like it. It's really a, so comfortable to wear. Oh my God. And this one is definitely going to hold up a lot better than my other white tees. I just have one from J. Crew and I have one from Aqua, which I love. It's like a longer tunic top. I just wore it yesterday. Um, and this one's in a size medium. So that's that one. 
And then the last one I have in that is a burgundy one. It's the exact same, excuse me, and this one is also in a size medium. It's the same exact shirt. I just wanted to show you really quickly. It's a really pretty color. I feel like it has a stain on it still. This might have to be thrown in the wash again. But again, love these ones. I've worn these both twice. And I really like them. I've just been living in them on the weekends. You know, they're just really easy to throw on. And again, I just wear this with like a tan cardigan and denim jeans. Really easy to just put together. And then the last shirt that I have that's like short sleeve, and then I'll show you guys my flannels. This one I really love. This is probably my favorite one I have. That's a new shirt, and I feel like I fold this shirt like 10 gajillion times in the store. This is a blue button-down shirt. It looks so cute on, and I love wearing it with the blue cardigan that I'm going to show you. It's a button-down with like um, these type of designs. I don't know how to describe them. It's just a white design. And then this is kind of like a kaleidoscope design. I think it's really cool. It's really pretty on, and then the back looks like this, and then it has the same design on the back. So it looks really cute on. I love wearing it with the blue cardigan and um, the lucky leggings that I have, and this one's in a size small. If I haven't been wearing the other two pairs of jeans, because I live in their jeans so much, because I feel like they're my best fitting jeans that I have. Um, if I'm not wearing just the denim, I'm living in the leggings. The leggings are so damn comfortable. I've worn them so much already. So that's the last shirt I have, and this one's in a size, did I say the size? A size small. Really love their shirts. They're just so comfortable to wear. Okay, now let's move on to some of my older pieces. And these are just two, let's move on to these. Okay, I'm just going to get up and show you guys. I'm probably going to stand for these. So I have two cardigan type sweaters from them. Well, the second one's just a sweater. It's like the only sweater I have from them because I have so many sweaters. You guys know I love sweaters. I just live in them in the winter time. So this one is a lighter cardigan. And this is more of like a summertime cardigan. And this one's in a size medium. Actually, it's not really a cardigan. It's kind of just like a jacket. I'll show it to you. It's really cute. I could also wear, I could have worn it with this too, but not really. It kind of clashes, but it has like, you know, those draped kind of um, sleeves, which I really like. I like, I love this style kind of jacket. And then it also has buttons just in case if you want to button it. And then the back is just a solid and it's kind of like a high low kind of um, uh, cardigan. And then it's like shorter in the back. So that's what that one looks like. And I love, like I said, I love wearing this with, like, the blue shirt that I just showed you. The, the Both of the blue shirts I love wearing this with. And this one's in a size medium. Really love this one. I really want the tan one, though, because I told Mom I really need a new tan cardigan. I don't have one anymore, and I feel like that goes a lot better with the stuff that I have. And then the other one I have, I love this sweater. I'm already obsessed with this. I wore this to work on Saturday, even though it's, like, so warm out. Well, Friday. And we were so busy. This is the um, sweater, the first sweater I've ever gotten from them, besides the purple one I had. So this is the first one I've gotten in like a long time from them. So it's this really, really cute like multicolored sweater. And it has tan, an off like white ivory shade, a blue, light blue, and a navy color. And this is what it looks like. I'll definitely try it on for you guys. Let me show you. It is so freaking cute. I love this, and I can't wait to wear this more in the fall time because when I wore it to work, it was, like, pretty, uh, it was pretty hot to wear this, but then I was, like, freezing for the last, like, two hours. Look how cute it is, right? It's, like, so 70s. It doesn't have pockets, though. I wish it had pockets because I thought this was a pocket, but it's just part of the sweater, so it's so cute. And then the back has the same design on it, so that's what the back looks like. So cute. And it's not like too heavy and it's not like a scratchy fabric. I think this is um, cashmere and it's a size small and I got this for 75% off because you get three tops and three bottoms for 75% off every month. So this was originally like 100 bucks, and we got it for like $30. It was such a steal. So yeah, really good price. 
And then the other jacket that I have that I'm going to show you is a really old lucky jacket. They don't even make stuff like this anymore. Like it, they used to like be very like younger looking and now I feel like they kind of appeal to like all ages. Um, but this was, oh, I love this jacket. It's just so cool. It's more of like a Japanese style to me because it has like the fish on it. And it has really pretty like floral design on the other side. And it has like gold embroidery and then it also has like blue um flowers on it and that's what it looks like i think it's so cool looking and then the back just has all the flowers on it i love this freaking jacket it's so cute sweat jacket i love sweat jackets as well i live in them so this is just really easy to wear i'm probably gonna wear this this month at some point and this is what this looks like and i'll zip it up for you Obviously, I don't wear it with this shirt. I would wear it with, like, that navy tank top that I just showed you. But isn't it so adorable? I love it. Right? It's so freaking cute. And that's, like, the last thing I'm going to try on for you guys. And I'll show you the denim jacket that I have. And then I'll go through the flannels. So this is the denim jacket that I have. We have, like, 10 gajillion denim jackets in the store. And this one is the... It's just a regular solid denim jacket and I'll put it on for you guys. Obviously denim jackets are like self-explanatory, but I could wear I could have worn this with this as well. But I don't like clashing denim. Like I like when my denim matches with my denim jackets. Um so I probably would not have worn it with this. I wore it with like a military style kind of navy jacket. So this is the denim jacket that I have. I wear this all the freaking time. I like live in this in the summertime. I love it. It's such a comfortable denim jacket. So I obviously needed a denim jacket from them. I mean, who doesn't need a denim jacket? So that's that one. And then we're going to go through these pieces here. So the first one I have is my one and only skirt from them. This is a very old skirt from them. And this is oh, so freaking cute. I love this skirt, but it's not hung up properly. So well, I, I can't show it to you properly if it looks like that. Um, so this one is a purple skirt, and it looks like this. And it's a high-waisted skirt, which is so cute. It kind of has like a Hawaiian style on it. But it's so cute with like black boots and black tights. I always wear it with black boots and black tights in the, sum in the winter time. In the summertime, I wear it with... Um, a black tank top and a denim vest and it looks so cute like that with like black sandals um so this is what this one looks like it has an elastic waistband has that hawaiian theme on it like green and purple and like tan leaves and flowers and then the back is the same but it's really really cute on i love this one i did wear this to work a couple of weeks ago but they told me this was too short to wear but I was still training and they said, well, you didn't really know that, so it's okay. Um, and he said, you're just going to be standing in, in, uh, at the register anyway. You're not really going to be helping people. And this is a size large and this fits me pretty nicely. It's not like too, um, big on me now, even though I, regardless if I've lost weight or not. So that's that one. I keep on scratching this scratch in my nose and it really, really hurts. So that's the skirt, and then I'm going to show you my flannels, which I am absolutely obsessed with flannels. I can never have enough. Um, and these are the three that I have from Lucky, and then I have two from Urban. So these are the three flannels that I have. So the first one is this really adorable, um, I'm just going to put them down here, really adorable orange flannel. It has um, a white base, and it has... Um, orange and navy stripes on it, plaid stripes on it, obviously. That's what a flannel is. I love wearing this one in the fall time. Their flannels are so, so soft. Love them. So that's this one. And then this one has a, like, folded back to it. Um, and it has, like, a button down. I actually never really noticed that. And it has the same design, obviously. But then the um, back has, like, a crisscross design on the bottom with the buttons. This one I wore in my fall makeup tutorial last year. If you guys want to see it on me, I wore it when I did that Lime Crime fall makeup tutorial. And I wore that shade Pumpkin on my lips. I'm wearing Rustic today. 
Um, I wanted to bust out one of my lime cream velveteens today. Um, but Rustic, Pumpkin, Saddle, and Salem and Stain are like my five favorite lippies to wear in, this, in the fall time. Um, so I already busted out one of mine. I feel like this one's a good like transition shade from like summer to fall. But this one I love and I love wearing it in that tutorial. And this one's in a shade, in a shade. Oh my God, why do I keep on saying that? In a size small. So that's this one. And then the next one I have is a blue flannel. This one, again, is so freaking cute. This one's an even softer fabric than the orange one. These are all from last year, and I think they were, I think they might have been buy one, get one 50% off. I think they're usually, like, flannels are pretty expensive, so I don't know if my mom saved anything on these, but basically everything else we've bought from them this year, we've saved money on. So this one is a blue turquoise flannel. I love it. It has, like, green and blue and navy in it. And this is what this one looks like. And actually, they are both the same. They're the, both the same, but this one's blue. I didn't realize this also has the... Oh, they all have that in the back. They all have, like, the button down in the back. So it's the same in the back. Same thing as the orange one. It has the buttons in the back. And then this one's in a size small. I can't wait to wear this one. This is probably going to be the first one that I wear as soon as it starts getting a little bit cooler outside, but they're not like too heavy, but honestly it's 85 degrees outside. So obviously I can't wear them yet, but I am very excited to bust them out towards like probably the end of the month. I'm probably not gonna wear them anytime soon in September because it's too hot for that. And this one's also in a size small. And then the last one I have, and this is the last piece of clothing I'm gonna show you, is this um, like burgundy, shade one. I don't know how to describe this color. Again, I'm like so horrible at describing color, but this one is a different um, plaid design. I don't know why the color is like all stupid looking. And this is what this one looks like. It's just hung up a little bit weird. Um, so this one is red with like a burgundy design in there and it has like navy in it and white and that's how that one looks like. And then the back is again the same deal with the regular design on the top and then it has the button down with the crisscross plaid in the back. And then this one's also a size small. And all of these, all of these flannels I love wearing with these pair of denims and my fry boots. I love wearing fry boots with plaid um, and I can't wait to bust those out as well. My ear is like really hurting now ever since I put that earring back in again. I'm gonna have to take these off before the end of the video. And yeah, um, but for work, I'm going to wear like a tank top underneath. Usually, sometimes I don't wear a tank top underneath um, with these, but I probably will have to. I'm going to have to for work, and then I'm going to wear it with like a long um, silver necklace, like my wings necklace that I wear all the time. So those are all the clothing pieces. And then, why does this hurt so much? Like... Okay, and then I have one belt from them that I just got. It's just a brown belt, and this one is the uh, Tala, and it's a size large, and I believe this one was half price. Um, I should have worn it today, though. I haven't worn it yet, um, but I really needed a new belt, so I figured just to get one from them because it's a really good price, and it's just a basic brown leather belt, so very excited to wear that. And then the last two items I'm going to show you are just two pieces of jewelry that I have from them. I got two necklaces from them recently, and these were 75% off because um, three accessories are 75% off. So I got the belt for 75% off and the two necklaces, so can't be that. So this one is a three-layer necklace, and it's gold and silver. It has two regular chains on the top, and then it has a little medallion on the bottom. It's just a gold and silver, like, teardrop kind of deal. It's really, really pretty. I've already worn this a couple of times, and I really like it. Um, and then it's the same on the back. So that's that one. And they have a lot with these type of chains, like this um, beading with, like, a bunch of different medallions on the bottom. And then this one is a turquoise and silver necklace. And it's just a long, regular necklace that looks like this. And I really liked it because I thought it was, like, really different. I don't know. I just really liked it. So it's silver and turquoise. And I really like that one. And that one was also 75% off. And that is it for my lucky clothing 
Lucky Brand Clothing Collection, and it's in this really cute, like, jewelry box from Lucky. So, yeah, that's it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really love shooting these, um, but I wanted to tell you guys, um, on Friday when I wore that sweater, that multicolored sweater with the navy tank top and the jeans, I just changed, uh, well, Lucky Leggings, because I wear the Lucky Leggings, like, so much. Um, I wore those to work and then when I got home all I did was to transition into like a more like uh, appropriate like outfit for the weather. I just put the navy cardigan on and I just left the tank top on and the lucky leggings um, because I would have been dying in that sweater. But yeah, that's it you guys. So please like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram CBW819 and my Twitter is ProcoFace819 and my Snapchat is ProcoFace819 and that's it. So today I'm just going to take off my makeup and eat something and relax for the rest of the night because I have not been giving myself enough time to relax while school has been going on. So yeah, I just really wanted to film a video today because I got home from work at 3 o'clock when I wasn't supposed to be done until 4 and it's like 4.30 right now. So yeah, that's it. Bye guys. Now I'm going to go eat something. And stuff my face later when my mom gets home. So bye. And I hope you guys liked my makeup today. I used the Anastasia Modern Renaissance palette with um, ColourPop Stereo and Kat Von D's um, Raw Power Metal Crush Shadow on the lid. Um, and then I used um, Lime Crimes Rustic um, and the NARS uh, Steven Klein palette for the contour and the blush. And then the highlight is Anastasia's So Hollywood. So yeah, bye.